Hey guys, if you're watching because you want to know my name is AJ. Welcome back to another episode of Let's Build a City. Today we're going to be doing something that I've wanted to do for a really long time. We started getting some ideas together during the uh, Christmas Eve episode, was it? When we uh, installed a couple of new mods to play around with. And we came across these ones. Now these look really weird, but they actually allow you to have a smooth incline instead of a step up like a vanilla Minecraft hat or ordinary Minecraft. We have like the minimum is like either half slab up or if you use snow, but then you've only got one color. Well, this sort of gives you the same sort of uh, uh, possibilities, but in different colors. So we can actually sort of make little ramps and stuff like that which is going to be really cool for like the incline to these highways and stuff like that i could change these up so instead of having the slab uh incline we could actually have a gradual sort of slope it could look pretty good but as soon as i saw this pink one uh i automatically thought "Ooh, a skate park that could be pretty cool so, I want to give it a go. I want to try and build a skate park today. And I, I really don't know how well this is going to go. It might look terrible. But if it does, at least we tried. Uh, if you didn't see that episode, by the way, on Christmas Eve, which I expect uh, a few of you should have missed at least because you should have been busy with Christmas, then you can go back and check out those some vehicles and some other cool, interesting uh, things added in these mods as well. I did miss these two entire sections, though, on that video. We've got a bunch of skyscraper glass. And these look pretty cool as skyscraper windows. Or, you know, I'm going to call them skyscraper glass. They're very, very cool. Uh, a load of sort of softer pastely colors is that what they're called yeah pastel yeah they're very pastely colored blocks and we've got some more sort of uh urgent colored blocks <laughs> very bright and distinguished a lot of different grays that could be handy uh, in some building aspects i mean imagine this one as some um, sort of uh detail uh, along the top of uh, an edge or something like that that looks pretty cool I got, I got like these really bad hiccups at the moment. I'm drinking this orange juice and it's making me have like burpy hiccups. It's horrible. Uh, a load of pinky blocks. Uh, I'm not worried about these. It also has the scaffolding scare stairs. We've already got these, but not in this many colors. I mean, there's pink and yellow and all sorts of colors uh, of those. Uh, some weird pillar blocks, lighting, uh, ceiling lights. I don't know what that is. Some very interesting bricks, which will make a great skyscraper. Very, very nice. Uh, I like those. And what else? Just very quickly. Uh, nothing in that one. And then in this one, it's mostly like different scaffolding style poles. Um, we've got some, some other little ramps in here and stuff like that. These are very, very bright colors, though. <laughs> <laughs> very very uh bright that's for sure uh but it gives us some other fence options as well we've got basically got any color fence that we want now as well are they called fences so i should be able to go fence oh my okay they all come up as fences as well you know that's this could actually work really well for today's episode though like how good does that look oh you've got to stand like that way for them Okay, like like I was thinking about like a grind, a grinding platform for the skateboards. Do you know what I mean? Very, very interesting. I'm very excited to sort of have a go at this. Now, uh, for our skate park, I don't want no X Games looking thing. I want to have like a, a, a street skate park. Do you know what I mean? I, just with some ramps, some drop-ins, maybe a half pipe, stuff like that. I used to actually be, I wouldn't say a skating fan because I've never in my entire life being able to skate i cannot skate i cannot ice skate i cannot rollerblade anything which is strange really because i don't have like terrible balance <laughs> it's not that my balance is awful uh, it's just that i've just never been able to like get the hang of it uh, it's just never been my thing uh like that uh, i just can't do it i just can't i can't i can't like stay on the board however i used to play a lot a lot of different um, skating games. Oh, I don't like that. Uh, a lot of different skating games. Uh, Tony Hawk's, like, on, on the old school, like, uh, I'm sure you guys have sort of uh, played them as well. The old school Tony Hawk's games, like, on the PSPs, I think it was. Like, on those, it was so cool, man, to play on those. 
Now, I would really like this one to come out longer, but I don't think we can because I think we're going to get these weird joins. Yeah, no, I'm going to have to keep it something like that. I want that break in the middle. There's some sort of aspects to, to this that I want to try and get in if I can. So... This is just a normal drop-in for like the, the the beginning people or people that want to go into a little bit of a uh, little bit of a score run, if you like. Then what we need is I think something maybe like three blocks wide, like this. Uh, maybe a little bit longer, and I want a little grinding, uh, a grind rail on there. Uh, but then what I'd also like is this to be down a little bit further here. And then down to like this or something. I don't know. We're, we're, we're giving it a little bit of sort of uh, uh, experiments at the moment. And the same on this side. I really like this pink though. This is actually like really, really skate parky pink. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. So there's like a different couple of different like lower grind rails and the higher uh, grind rails. If we go into fence, do we have... So we've got a black fence. That would work very well as the grind rail. But I would love to have, like, the other fancy style, like like these fancy styles, if possible. Ah, there is a black. We could go with a double one or a single one. Either black or grey would also be nice as well. So there's the double one. I think the double one makes it look very um, scaffoldy. But the single, oops, that's not there. The single one, I know it's not centred, it doesn't need to be centred. Uh, like that, they got weird hitboxes too. See, that looks that looks really nice. If there's a grey one, it would be even better. But I'd happily stick with black. Ah, there is some grey ones right at the top. I can't believe I missed those. Uh, nope. <laughs> okay, I think that's pretty cool. I think that's really really nice. Uh, I don't think I really want it too much longer than that either. Uh, and then we've got the hard bit uh, that I need to have probably a little bit of practice on. And that's, uh, I'm just going to do like one half of a half, uh, one half of a half pipe. Is it called a quarter pipe? It sounds so wrong, a quarter pipe. But basically just like one ramp. Uh, I think we want this three blocks high. For, is that five blocks wide? Five blocks should be about, about right. And then what we need to do is we need to actually make these ramp down as sharp as possible. Ooh. That could be some, like, potential cool stuff as well. Um, I think I need it sharper than that. Oops. Okay, there's going to be a little bit of finagling involved with this. I'll tell you what, I'm going to do some finagling with it. And I shall be back uh, once I've got this sort of half pipe in. And I'll show you what ones I used if you guys are interested, okay? All right, that's as smooth as a ramp as I can get. And you know what? I'm actually really happy with that. We can then get something like these to go along the top. Ah, oh, no, because it's not a full block. Ah, okay, we'll figure that something out like that later. Now, I want a half pipe in here too, so we need to build two of these. So the way that i done this is I had three blocks high. Uh, we want the half pipe. I think I want the half pipe some, somewhat in the middle. Uh, three blocks high of these and however many wide that we want. So I'm going to go like five. Well, you can probably go like seven blocks wide for this one and make it like a wide half pipe. And then I'm going to just click on them to make it easier. I got this one, which is the 10 high one. It, it, there's some like tricky little bits about it because these end up going higher than what the blocks are. And from the back, it looks really weird. But we hide that up by grabbing these ones and sort of like basically putting like a half slab on top of it like that. Uh, we then need the full blocks to go underneath to fill up that void space. And then we grab... Th oh, is it just another full one? Yeah, must be just another full one to get that sort of angle. Obviously, we're working in Minecraft. We're already pushing the limits of Minecraft by doing anything like this. And we're pushing the limits of this mod by trying to make sort of curves out of it. Uh, I think we've done pretty well here, but that gives us that little curve. Now, we want another one going upwards. 
But uh, we don't want it to go up instantly because otherwise we're sort of going to have this uh, point at the bottom, aren't we? What we need to do is we need to have a little bit of a flat section going on before it goes back up. I don't know how many. Would three be enough? I think that would be about right. And then we add one more because this is the one that's going to start going up. Now. Whoops. Hello. Uh, no, don't stick those up there. <laughs> yeah, that should work. That should work really nicely. Uh, full blocks. And full blocks behind here as well. These ones go on top. Whoops. Like that. No. Well, these could be a little bit tricky to place sometimes. Nope. No. These sort of, they, they can click a little bit weird sometimes. The hitbox for them is like at the bottom. Uh, which is a little bit strange. I, 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 maybe there must be a reason, I'm sure, why they've put the hitbox like right at the bottom of these. Um, maybe for using them for their intended purpose. Uh, which is, I think, all like skyscraper stuff, uh, then it might make a little bit more sense. Oh, and that one in there. Yeah, okay, I'm happy with that. Now, to get ourselves right up to the top where we need, have we got like a, would it be good to have like a black tarmac -y block? One, two, three. That would then go on there. But that looks really weird. Or we add another one. No, that looks really weird too. Hmm. It would be it'd be cool if I could have those the bars along the top, but then you have to go so uh, so much higher. Nope. Okay. Uh, let's stay. <laughs> this isn't too bad. We need some little grind rails and stuff like that around the place. Uh, but we also need a couple of more things, more probably important things. Uh, number one being, I think we should just reshape this river a little bit. Uh, to suit oh and these are the stairs aren't they they're the right way up okay that's easy enough for me to do then so instead of having like this sort of curved out part which we don't really need now that we've got a skate park here we might as well square this off really nicely like that yep uh, with the slabs along the top uh, this corner I'm not too bothered with uh, we do want a nice high fence though, like an iron bar fence uh, going up and around the place, sort of surrounding it. Uh, this way it stops the kids from jumping into the river. I don't think that would be the smartest thing for us to leave sort of open. And it also stops the skateboards if they fly off from going into the water as well. So I'm going to put a fence all the way around. I'm going to sort of move this river over uh, a little bit. And then we'll work on a little bit of a floor and some markings and stuff like that and sort of polish it up a little bit because we're very basic at the minute i think we can get this a lot better okay all right just sprucing up the outside fence here just a little bit i uh, have some bushes and some sort of hedgerows coming along here uh, and then it's just not a boring iron fence is it it's a real shame that there's no skateboards in minecraft i don't even have a mod that has a skateboard uh maybe there's one but uh i can't see how it would work minecraft just doesn't have the sort of physics to uh understand like all the skateboard stuff and you know minecraft has gravity but it's not really the best gravity of that either is it it's, it's not a physics game no definitely not designed to be but this is already with the fence around it looks a lot more like a skate park i think by changing the uh floor as well uh will help a tremendous amount so let's just do a big section of it something like that for the moment and what do we want to go with do you want to go with a dark road style tarmac you know the, the dark stone um i think that's a little plain we'll try it 48 uh replace grass with 48 yeah it's a little bit too uh plain do you know what i mean there's nothing there's nothing to it we need some kind of texture to it. 112 could work. Uh, 48 with 112. No, you know, I think stone is the best. I think the nice darkness to it will, will really help. And then we need to do the same thing 
over here as well. It's going to be a tricky one. I'm going to do something like that. Oops. Uh, like that. There we go. Okay, so we've got a nice black tarmac sort of section here now. Do we have any other colours in here? The blue could look pretty nice. The yellow, not so much. The blue's a possibility, though. What if we made some of the bits blue? Like, we grab that one and the eight high one. And what if we made these edge ones into blue ones? Just to get that, like, second color in here. Oops. It's like a brand, it's, oops, it's a brand new skate park. Nothing's been scratched yet. <laughs> there's no, there's no bent grinding rails as someone's fell off one. Uh, let's make the middle of these blue as well. And try and accent that up a little bit. Oh, they sort of like, oh, they sprang up to the top then. Okay. I think the blue is actually really helping. Maybe we should do blue on the outsides of the ramps as well. And really sort of uh, take take uh, that sort of as part of it. So one, two, three. That one and that one. That one goes there. What size is that? Eight. And. Ten. Uh, eight. And. 10, 8 should go there, 10 should go there. Oh, and then we have that top one, yeah, 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 I remember. Uh, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. Uh, I've got two eights now. <laughs> How did I get two eights? That one, that one, that one. And then was it this one along? Nope, it's one like, smaller than that. Six. I tried to go with just sticking with the even numbers, uh, if possible, and I think I did. I think I got even numbers everywhere. Oh, yeah. Now, that's looking cool. I need to do that on that one and the uh, two sides of the small sort of drop-in ones. But let's add some more rails. If we change the rails to be blue grinding rails, uh, fence, yeah, to be that sort of same blue, I think we've got our color scheme. Oh, that looks so cool. Okay, uh, we'll have like another one here. This feels so much like the tutorial of Tony, uh, like an old, old Tony Hawk's game or something like that, don't you think? Uh, oh, we'll need something like, I think just like that one as a box. Now, I, I never really understood what these were used for. I never used the boxes, even at the skate park that's somewhat local to me. Um, I never used them. I think they're for like uh, ground, you know, just ground tricks, you know, manuals and 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 and, and heel flips while trying to like not get off, trying to keep only two wheels of the board on the ground and sort of keeping two up uh, in the air. Uh, so there's like a little platform for that with the blue outline around it uh, as well. Uh, it would be cool if we could maybe. What does it look like if we go up with these? Oops. Yeah, that wouldn't be a bad one. <clears throat> oh, my voice done like this reverb. <laughs> Let's say we had something like that. And then made these ones higher. Yeah, so there's like a, a jump high grind as well going on uh, for the more pros. Um, it'd be cool to have some kind of graffiti on the floor. Um, I don't think we really have anything for that. Uh, but maybe just mixing in some different colored clay uh, will give that sort of impression. Like how we done with the primary school um, floor. Uh, what was it? Uh, the primary school uh, playground. Uh, we had a very sort of similar way of doing it by using clay and sort of mixing it in, in together. So if we had something like... Oops. I want to try and do like a, a some sort of like tags, you know, like graffiti tags on the on the floor, like where where people have like tagged the spots. Now, I am certainly no graffiti artist, especially not in a space this small. Uh, 
but uh, I think if we just sort of mix uh, a few different colors together here, I think it could be pretty nice. Yeah, see, that's already really, really helping. Um, I wonder if we could use some sort of white lines as well to make it look like uh, the tarmac has um, been sort of torn up a little bit by some of the boards and the wheels and stuff like that. That could be an idea. And let's go underneath here as well. Or at this point, not underneath it. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, see that? Just nice little subtle touch like that. Oh, some benches. Um, table. There's always somewhere sit at these. And chair. Not those ones. Sofa. No. Uh, couch. Yeah, that one. I don't know why there's two similar looking ones. But yeah, there's always like a little uh, bench in these. And the table apparently has to all face the same direction. There we go. Yeah, like, like those little sort of table things going on. We'll have another one over here. Okay. Let me put the blue down, and I'll have, an, I'll have a think to see if I can think of any other ideas, and I should be back to finish off, okay? <laughs> I like All it. All right, I've got the blue on everything now. It looks really nice. That's polished the place up nicely. And uh, because this was only two blocks high exactly, I was able to put a little back fence on this part as well, which is cool. Uh, I just thought maybe I looked at the street lights, and I thought, well, maybe we should have some lights actually on the inside. Uh, of here, some like uh, spotlighty style ones. So I don't want them the same design as, as the street lights, obviously. Uh, I want to have something uh, a little bit simpler, like a little bit cheaper looking, maybe, because it's obviously just a skate park. The city isn't a huge fan of it. So we'll have something like that. Or like that. And we just have like a small little lip. Ooh, you got a shift click on them. Yeah, something like that. So we'll have one here, and we'll have one. It would be smart to have it sort of overhanging the half pipe too much. So we'll face it this direction. And how high? Uh, we've gone higher than those ones. I wanted to. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I wanted to go higher than those ones because obviously if the skateboard goes up in the air, we don't want it to hit and smash it, do we? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That one and that one. And nope. How am I going to do this? Like that one. And that one. Okay, that should be enough lying in here. Just a couple of them. I don't want to, like, uh, get in the way, do we? Okay, that looks so cool. Let's turn the shaders on. Now, it's been many years since I've played a Tony Hawk's game. Many, many years. But can I do some kind of scoring run with this? Let's try it. Let's try it. I'm going to make this up as I go along. I'm going to pretend that we're on a skateboard. Just just bear with me here, guys. So, uh, we're going to... Let's start off basic. We're just going to kick flip in. Ooh, a little bit of lag. Let's try it again. We're going to kick flip in. Shoo, down into a... Wow, it doesn't like me coming down there. Into a, uh, a nose manual. We nose manual all the way along. We're going to uh, heel flip into 50-50 uh, slide along the here. We're going to pop shove it off. Hey, I, I still know some of my stuff. Pop shove it off uh, up the quarter pipe into an eggplant. Uh, we're then going to 180 back down again. Uh, up this section, uh, a double... What is it like? Uh, there was heel flip, kick flip. Oh man, I used to be so knowledgeable. I knew, never skated before, but I used to be so knowledgeable uh, about the about the moves. I can't really remember uh, anything anymore. There was some really like sick, sick flips that you could do. I don't know. That was too bad. What was that like? A, like a that was probably like a fifty point scorer or something like that. But it looks pretty sick, right? That's where we're gonna leave it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, then hit that like button. If you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe. We shall see you in the next episode.